This video tutorial will show you how to apply texture to your models. Let's upload the sample project. In this sample project, we see several scans and one fused model. We will use texture information from the raw scans and apply it to the fused model. It's important for the raw scans and fused model not to have been transposed in relations to one another. This means not using the transformation tool, which we talk about in another tutorial. Before texturizing, we recommend simplifying the model. This can be done by using the Mesh Simplification option in the Tools panel. Simplification was done without the loss of detailization, yet our model is now simplified consisting of about 32,000 polygons. So let's open the Texture tab. Choose the model you'd like to texturize. Choose the scan with which the model was created. There are two ways to texturize your model, one that's called Atlas and another one that's called Triangle Maps. They differ by the way textured data is stored. Let's choose the Atlas method. We click Apply and Wait. After texturizing completes, we can adjust brightness, contrast, gamma, Let's take a look at the results. The software tried to minimize the number of fragments we get. Now let's take a look at the second method of texturizing called triangle maps. Choose Texture Size, the number of estimated texture files will be displayed below. Click Apply to begin. Sometimes it's useful to switch off lighting in the control panel to evaluate quality of texture. Let's have a look at the model. Each polygon was rendered into a specific point in the texture file. The third method of texturization is called Use Existing Atlas UV, and it is not meant for UV unwrapping, but rather for changing texture resolution. This is useful when you want to increase or decrease texture resolution. That's it. Happy texturizing!